I think there are two types of people when it comes to motorbikes. There is the kind of people who, he, upon hearing this, that annoying loud sounds of a motorcycle going miles away, but you can still hear it like it's here. And they go, ooh, look, look, it's, this is the, the sound from the, the, the ECC engine and it, it can go up so many, many, many kilometers and it's, oh, it's awesome. <laughs> and there's the other kind of people who turn to these idiots and say, shut up. I don't care. I can't even begin to tell you how much I don't care. I already have to stand that annoying sound coming from the motorbike itself. I don't want to hear the one coming from you, so shut up. You know, I mean, I don't hate them because, yeah, I, I'm, I'm the second group. I don't hate them because they're dangerous. You know, some people hate motorbikes because they're so dangerous, they pose, pose a threat to the society, you know, like, they don't, the reason why the families are falling apart or something. No, because I think they're less dangerous than cars. Because if you're a biker and if you have an accident, there's a very good chance that you will be the one who dies or gets injured or whatever. You know, because if, if you're driving a car, if you hit something, if you <laughs> What happened? But there was a pedestrian walking, you just ran over him. Oh well. Let's go to the car wash. I don't want all this blood on my vehicle. Do you know? But if you're a motorbike, if you hit something, you'll fall yourself. That's an idiotic thing to do. There are people, people can be reckless in anything, you know. Like, if you're a reckless motorbike driver, rider, whatever, you might, you might hurt other people as well as yourself. But if you're reckless, you can hurt someone with, you know, with a needle that you find in the floor. So, that's that. No, but I, but I hate them because of the sounds that it make, that annoying, annoying sound. Uh, but my friend, who is one of those annoying people, told me that that sound actually has a function. You know, he said, they, they're that's that loud, not because they, they haven't invented silences in the world of motorbikes yet, but because they, they need to be noticed in the traffic. Now, I do understand that because no one cares about them in the traffic. You know, if you see a pedestrian walking in the middle of the road, you will pay more respect to him than you would a motorbiker who is just going his way in the traffic. This is a true story. Once in the traffic, I was in a bus and I saw this scenario happen in front of us. That was a minibus and I hate minibuses, but that's another story. That was a motorbike and a taxi, right? And waiting at the, at the traffic lights to check the, at the stop. And I saw the driver of the minibus just saying, What are you doing? Are you? Get, out, get out of the line. What are you doing? Why are you there? And the, and the biker was saying, what, what, what? I mean, it's just a road, um, I drive, I am, what, what, what do you mean? He was saying, what the hell are you doing there? What is, get out, get out of, get out, get out there. And he'd actually did. The biker didn't want to get in trouble. He said, what, 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 all right. And he ran off another way. That's how much people hate them. So they need to be noticed. I understand that, but I think that's a very bad way to be noticed. That sounded annoying sound that people associate with motorbikes. Because think about it, everybody hates you and you're telling them that you're coming in the way that gets you hated even more. Because it can cause scenarios like this. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't be mistaken, that's a 200cc motorbike coming. What did you just say? No, no, it's just it's a motorbike. I, I hate them. I hate them so much. Okay, I think it's coming from the left. Ready? Okay, on count of three. One, two, three. Open the door, get him, get him, get, kill him. Bastard. 